everyone, Terry Cruz here, and this is NHL 24 on EA Sports. Hey everybody, Terry Cruz is back with another mid-game matchup, and it's Saturday Prime Time. As for this next game, we've got another huge matchup, as we're about to be seeing it right from here. And that's right, we are about to be finding out the next game for it now. Silver Spoon here, and it's this is where we're calling for. This Canadian versus the American team that's happening here for tonight's game. The Montreal Canadiens and Dallas Stars. Now we know before the Dallas Stars have already lost two games back then in the season, but looking for a chance to make the win and for a possible run that will be taking this one thing over right at the same time. As you may already notice, this is a tough one that nobody's ever gotten. And last season was a big loss for the Canadians as the Penguins destroyed them. But right now, we have to find out if the Montreal Canadiens can make a comeback switch to have the rally up. And right now, here are the starting groups right now in between. Nick Suzuki and Cole Caulfield. Now, there are no X-Factor players here for the Canadians, but this is where it all turns out. With the third liability, tape to tape, and no contest great buck paddling. Right in between for the zones. And the other side is Cole Caulfield. With a 1T, make it snappy, and snipe. Now, let's head over into the dark star zone. We've got some great, great players that are on the X-Factors. All three. As we start up, Jason Robertson. Has a snipe on his Ely puck settling. He has his, one of his own best techniques out there. And he also makes a great puck on string. Makes it snappy, no contest, all alone with a breakaway finish, and relentless. The off balance shots and passes. On the next player we got is Myro Heskinen with an in reverse skating ability going backwards. And that one is a lot that tough to take encouragement to go backward in between. Then it's Jake Ottinger, your starting goaltender, as right now with the Energizer. Desperation saves in the maximized team energy. He's all been fueled and looking for our biggest saves of the night. Also, Roop Hins is one of his gotten own big timing look. It's wheels. The elite skate with the puck does it all. With incredible ankle breaking, puck on string, Ely edges and make it snappy. Last but not least we have is Joe Pavelski. He makes a big tipper right in the Ely shot deflections and it's great to keep that one here for the magnetic, make a snipe, four leader and relentless. Now I know that Joe Pavelski might be able to take this one, so let's find out how this turns out. And for the Montreal Canadiens starting goaltender, we have one of each, Sam Martinbelt, Kaden Premier, and Jake Allen. Let's head on in to Dallas as we stand by. We have another courtesy to take away. It's Son of Beast, and he's along with another group as right now the head starter to take it all. We have it across right from the slot that we're all saying is test two. And finally, on the other side of the range, we have here, it goes for one. As Fan is in the center ice. And that will be your starting group on the other side of the play of the offense and defense from Canadians and from Stars. Now let's get into this game. We'll see you all later for the post game show. Guys, it's all yours. Good evening, everyone, and it's time for some action at the hockey. This is NHL on EA Sports. With me, along with my broadcasting partner of Son of Beast and Finn. Here we're about to start and we're ready to go. Let's do this. The team is starting right now. Here's Suzuki, he will start things off right now. Heskinen will have the bucket right in bounding. Takes the pass to Robertson. He went down bubble hard. Takes the middle with Pavelski. Shot! It is as tough when to take the save here first. Montreal back the other way and now finds Suzuki. Right in the slot. Ottinger is going to hold it up with the save. And now he gives it off to Pavelski. 
No penalty called on Montreal Canadiens, and now it goes back to Hanks. Here's Robertson's shot. It gets blocked, and it's Matt Bissett with the puck. And because that blocked shot, it was not even going to get there in time. He really would have to like try to bangle this um, down. It's not really easy enough to try to keep him right in from the hedge. Here's Hanks right now, Suter. Suter lost the puck, almost may have been left it out. Suzuki fine again to Clawfield. Kyrenfield right in the middle. Takes a little bit of a swipe, but now he has it over against the Johnston. The Stars are back in the offense. Not enough to take that one with the shot. Anderson right towards the left wing. Now give off to Slavkovsky. Slavkovsky inside. Good save there by Ottinger. The Ottinger got it all perfect down. Maybe a tough one to try to leave it off the gap. Here's Ben. Shot is a, takes it out big deep here. And it turned away to go with another huge save. Down off shot. Ben on his back slug. Turn it off. Allen save. Holton with only 16.32 to go. And that will be your starting lineup for your goaltender. As for right now, we're starting off with the game. It is still no score as the Dallas Stars are trying to get right into work. Here's Go, now finding Scaliger. Galaka right in towards the middle, and now finding Lindell. He goes to Marchman right now, swings it over to Segan. Looks like finding open. Gallagher take that save and took it away. For the defense, Ironger with a save inbound. Now finds Stutzny. And he goes into the wall that Patterson was really like trying to flicks them up. Not really a perfect way to just set them down the scores, but they're just trying to make that one feel like that is, and really that tough to stop out of here. The puck clears out as now the Stars will have their inbound with just only 15 set minutes to go. Lung missed right towards the wing. In the middle, Allen with the pass save. Gets back up to a, a great stop. The energy right down here from the Canadians, not enough to take the momentum out there. Montreal back the airway as Pearson will have one. Fires away and it's stopped again by Ottinger. Ottinger had a lot of a hard, difficulty time, but this was not always the way that he was trying to make that one feel like he's all in hands. In the middle, Harley. Not enough to beat that one in time as Allen will have that gloved up and ready for the faceoff. Both teams set, ready for the faceoff. Still no score in the game as we are looking for an hour way to get right into this, into the game. The Stars wins the faceoff. Johnston looks the middle to get it off. Gives it past to Hakapa. Now back to Hakapa. Cross toward the lane, in the middle! Take it out with a big slap out for Ireland and he turns it over. Messina with the puck now into the wing. Dallas back into the other side of the offensive zone, now on its way down to Harley. Harley moving around to Ben. Give off to Hakapa, now in the middle is Dantanov. Dantanov wants to go back to Harley again. A lot of passing motion for the Dallas Star team. And oh, Johnston didn't get that one deflection in there. Well, it was because I was looking at it, it was the pass that was going to happen like that. It didn't go really easy enough at all because that wasn't enough to get their momentum. Armia right into in the middle. Takes a swipe down as Hankapal will have it back. Now Pavelski will have his turn. Now give it over again to Harley. He finds Robertson. In the middle bag, he scores! It's Prince. Hank with his first goal. It's a 118 in a career game. Had to start right with the Stars. This is whatever happens now. Because Hintz really got that one off after Robinson, and he gives it off to Hintz. you got to make that one credit, because Rope Hintz has gotten snappy right towards the backhand. He just really made that one easier enough. Stars take the one nothing lead in, into the first game at, right now in the first period, and Harris will have that puck now finds Caulfield. Blocks it up by Henskinen. Now finds Pavelski, now over again to Hintz. Hintz on the fast break with Reels. 
Passes. Oh, he just didn't get that pass to Robertson this time. Suzuki will have the puck here right into the offensive slot. The pass. Pavelski will have it down here now. Give it back to Suter. Back to Disney. For the pass. Robertson. Try to hold it from the corner. Now have it to Heskinen. Now find Sutter. He looks to Heskinen. Shoots it away. Allen gloves it up. We are at the midway mark of the period with only 10 minutes left. This is what happens. The boom in the center ice. That goes down hard. The tough team is inbound ready for another faceoff. The Dallas got a great start here for just a 1-0 lead in the game. After a season 2 loss against the Buffalo Sabres, they're looking away to get right down in and then try to take them out. Anderson give out to Newhook. Battle collision for the Stars. Now it goes back the airway into Montreal zone. Slavikovsky will have the puck here right into the offensive zone. Now in its Stars territory. And Eidinger stop away. 9.20 remaining in the first. Looking to get more right nearby. Now ready for another faceoff. Here's another look of the call. As right now, in between the two. Marchin stops the puck. And he's all alone. One on one, gloved by Allen. That's a tricky shot right here, but a go over replay, it's a tough one to be clear. You can definitely spot the target right over here. There's a, a bunch of star collisions over here. They are trying to get that one puck right away. You can definitely spot it in between right, right from the zone. And when that one was coming by, he was running in, into each other. When you go back from here, that was the biggest tough one into the center of the ice. This is a great puck battling. That is a great takeover to go with the other way. For the next play, it is still coming down here hard. As right now, Fosca lost the faceoff and it's Matheson with the puck. Anderson right towards in the center of the zone. Makes his way down. Lindell takes it over. Now I'm finding D'Angelo now over to Smith. He gives it off to Fosca. In toward the corner. Taking a smash hit for the Canadians, and now back again to Lundvest. Here's Lindell right towards the outside of his range, and Lundvest to Smith. Smith on a shot. He flexed and put it back in. It's stopped by Allen. Lundvest finds Lindell. And look at this. This is a full pressure range. Put a shot. Get off the skater and goes on Kakovich, and it's going back the other way. Smith still holding. Taking a bit down on here. And he leaves out of the zone. Now it's Lepkowski back the other way. Lungus with the puck now going over to Smith. There's still a lot of attackers there going on. I might have to tell you that. Why? There might be another way to get that one right down here to try to stop one. Lungus finds Danton on and now over to Johnston. Lost the puck. Looks over to Bandanov. Trying to take him out and down as Ben has it back. Caulfield with the takeaway. Stops the inbound as Harley has it back. Looks over to Ben. Ben looks to Harley. Shot! Take the rebound and stopped away by Allen. Diagonal pass. Lost it again as Byron will have it back. 5.40 left to go in the first period as they're battling for the loose puck. And Hankapa will have it back. Here's Segan. Shot! Way too wide. Hankapa finds Harley. Now takes it over to Hankapa. Now again to Segan. And we're now in full pressure. Harley, taken about. Allen puts a stop. Under five minutes remaining. This one's going to be a hard pressure. Well, not for long because they're getting away with that. That's not what they all called for. They're getting out of here right away. I have a look for Jason Robertson, it's right now he has a snipe on his puck and settling to take that one over for his higher use of his angle. He can try to take that one over here, he might have that full pressure in range and try to use his skill. I know the other player for Suzuki may have a tough feeling for the range, but he might have it all down to make that one stop. I'll be keeping an eyes on those two to have that one back. Shot he scores! It's Pavelski! That's 450 goals in this game! The career hard, all crushed out. That's what Pavelski does. 
after Robinson. You make that clear or a pass to swing around and swipe it around. Make the spin and then goes like, you know what? Take that one out there. I'm going to go for it. And he had that one in. That was Bogelski with the spin around and then look at the target. This tech range was turning to be inside out. And it's not just a lot of the players who have that mistake in, but this was a very good top offense that they're putting up a rebound. Because Allen was ready to go, he wasn't able to take that one here as long as he needed. I'll have to watch on him for Joe Babowski if he can get another one in there. Back to you all. Now here's Evans. He's going to have some puck here with only 345 left. Armia has got it out here right towards the corner. Looks to Evans. Fire around it. Eilinger stop again. Hintz recoups the puck as the play continues. Robertson towards the corner. And he won't make up that play again. Deep pass to Pazisa. Pazita went toward into the right wing. In zone. Hooked away by Marchman. Looks to Harley. Harley trying to give it, can you take a stick away as Seager will have it back. Nobody on offense took it here. Armia with the puck now back the other way. Looks to pass to Harris. Xavier will have it now again to Evans. He's all alone. Takes a shot. Had it up on another stop by another Ottinger. Marchman right towards inside. Looks to Seagan. Back in. Oh, almost made that one in there. And that was close to be there. But he still had it all. Not a choice when you make this option. Because of Allen, he was almost going to get that one in the way. That was very close, but don't get away with that. You do not want to make the puck settle out to try to stop one. Gallagher lost that one with the puck. We are down to one minute remaining in the first. Gallagher shot Eilinger with the save. We are under one minute now as right now we're ready to get right into this for the second period. And as of now we will get a fresh clean of ice and we'll be back here with you shortly. Here's Kakovic, he will have that puck. Dernoff blocked away. Got that crotch down. They're all looking for it. Not just anybody's idea. They're just trying to make that one say, get out of here. You don't want to make that one feel like you're hard enough to do. That's not to Ben. Headshot with the rebound. Tucks it. Oh my goodness. And they were saying, Allen stopped out. Take the buzz beater. And it's a flex up back to the net. What a wild first period. And it's all thanks for Pavelski. We'll get to the second period when we come back after the break. 2-0 is the score. Welcome back to Dallas as we're about to start the second period of the game. We are on our way and let's get into this. We've got a great two goals in between for the Dallas Stars as right now Joe Pavelski and the other side of it I'm hitting got a great look. Let's have a look from your moment here, Santa Piece, of how they did. Well, they were really that fantastic. I was really, really good to see what, how they did here with this offense. This has been really been turning out the great. They do the best thing as they all can do. They really are putting a lot of strength. They're getting a lot of that targets down, but this was a hard one that they maintained to pressure it. Every time they wanted to get this one thing done, they really are setting it up with the scores. I like it when their hustle is inbound. They want to just go over and reset this. If you say, hey, we got to go over to replay again. Let's run it again. That's what we're doing this year, guys. That's a lot of pressuring that they are going to get right into this. Thank you so much for your time. My pleasure. Robertson with the puck now finds Harvey. Wide open shot range. Allen denies the shot. Caulfield fires it out. The Stars will get their offense back in transition. Canada pass went too wide. Canada got a little too close to the goaltender. Fires Johnson. Shot stopped made by Allen. Goes back to Hankapa. And now Harley will have his offense taking him down. Pulsing it. Allen denies the shot. And it goes with a saving man with just 17 or 8 to go. Now they're ready to do it in our offense again. It's still a 2 0 game on a start run. Canadians win the face off. Magnuson right down again to Anderson. 
on the pressure steam attack. That takes it over as Johnson has it back. He now gives over to Ben. Ben on his way down, now fighting again to Danonov. Back pass to Hankapov. Newbook's got him now right here into the offense zone. Slides it across. What a smackdown. That is the biggest motion I've ever seen. Yeah, they're telling it again that much because stars, they're just going to get that one away. They wanted to stop one. They really are going to hit that one a lot that hard. Not pretty much everybody's favorite, but they're getting over this one now. What a great save by Allen. Looks like the top puck is cleared out. Now Hiskin and will find Sutter. Fires around the net, and Seagan gives it back to Dunchney. Now can need the pun. Bad shot! Hit off the sick. Got to Heskinen. They're moving the puck back and forth, in between the two. Ben still has one. Sutter with the puck. And now Mordehan will have it right the other way, give it off to go. Julie right into it. Take it inbound. Marchand shot. Backhand denied by Allen. Oh, he's getting there good now. He just got much better in the second period. May not be enough to make that call if he wanted to go over it again. Jake Ottinger has an energized ability, but he has all of it stable down. He makes that one a great save, and he was all energetic. It's a hard one to take this in his own time, but this offense will take it a lot much carry on than you will have. This is a tough range in offense, and I will see what happens if Jake Ottinger has a motion to take over it. Back to you. Delay penalty is whistled, and right now the power play is on for the Dallas Stars. Peterson in the penalty box, ready for the power play. The Stars will have their start range for the power play motion, which is only 13.51 to go. Star back inbound. Pavelski has it in cover in the corner. Now finds Heskinen. Robertson shot. Allen hold it away for just only 13.40 to go. Now the win for the faceoff of the Stars. Now back to Robertson. He makes it back to Hens. Great puck movement. Heskin and give it back to Hens. Hens on his way. In the middle! Take the rebound, stopped away by a defender as Evans takes it back. Time to go for Shurkin and a shot. Good stop by Ottinger. Ottinger just really got a great, a great timing out there. I'm mostly saying he's gotten best. Pavelski lost that pop. Now finds Robertson now finding Heskinen. Back to Robertson and over to Hens. He gives the bang, takes a shot with deflection, not enough to get there. Allen will try to hold that puck. And Pavelski was get, trying to get that one deflection in, but Hens didn't have the right one to take in cover and bound. Well, it might be a tough way to get this one done. You're never going to make that save. You just got to get that one right way done. The win. Oh, almost made that one out there. Buck recover by Lundqvist. March in, now finally against Segan. 30 seconds in the power play. Save me by Allen. The puck will clear out for the zone, and the Dallas will have their possession before a time power play is up. He finds Lundqvist. Across the line, towards the back. Looks like he's almost to get out there and ready to go. The power play is over for the Dallas Stars as they're out there back in even strength. This was a lot of courtesy that they are trying to keep that one with a lot of defensive rumble takedown. I know this was happening because that was a lot of a takedown to this motion. They're doing a lot best thing as they can. Not everybody's great at it, but keeping a power play in a live is a hard thing to do. Nobody's going to be able to try to keep that one up with the scores. If they're going to try to like go over it and then play and bounce and take that pass and do it again. That's the hard work that they got to do. Here's Hank Bush on the pass. Johnson! Oh, Allen! What a mighty save. And go, we'll have it back. Sarkovsky right in the center now finding new look. 
He's on his way down to the Stars territory. Slap a cut in it. Ottinger got a big use out of it. Johnston with the puck. Oh, hello. That's a rough thing on the cross check. And this is going to be on the Canadians. That 40 is going to be a smash. That's what happens now, Baron. You don't mess up with the team. Wow. If this was a big bang, that is definitely a hot hard. They do not like their boarding, and we do not want that to be out. Now, back again. Pavelski will give it over again to Robertson. Takes a swing. Shots out of it for Allen. Heston then now finds Robertson. Robertson gets bumped out. Suzuki takes over the puck. And now Heskinen will have it back. Rolling right around it with just only 9.47 to go. Pack's broken up the play. Pavelski tries to give it a little duration. Now buying Ben. Robinson finding Heskinen. Shoots! Glove the way away, Allen. 9.31 to go in the second period. It is still coming down here fast. Just past the midway mark of the period. Now both teams set, ready to take the face off inbound. Just trying to keep an eyes on here. They're just going to get that one lucky enough to try to make a stop out of it. Julie will have to cover that one puck out of here. And now finding Lundqvist over again to the Ben. Ben racing across the inside. Now ends the, in the Montreal Canadian zone. Hits finding now to Dutchney. And Lundqvist shot. He scores! Look at that. The rocket blast. Puts up, and Pavelski's team got Lundqvist with a power play goal. This was all that happens, and you could see that Lundqvist was outside. He got a fire out of it. It just went quick pass. After Vince's pass, watch here. He moves over here from quick transition. When he goes from right, he just made that one right its way towards again, as Hintz goes his way down and gives off the Lundqvist. That's a quick power in, but you've got to make that connection go with the uh, with the L-shaped motion. They're doing it a lot much better than they had that one down for last season. But the pass out of the way by Ellinger. Here's Harley back to Hintz, and now again to Robertson. Looks it right around again as right now Pavelski gives it over to Hankapa. Now find Pavelski out of there. Shoots away, way high off the mark. Puck Lee in, inbound, and now Dallas will have to regain their possession again. They're on a good timing run. I know this was very that tricky, but don't be amazed. They just really wanted to get this one done. Caulfield back again to Baroon. Flings away. No, no, uh, no puck out of here. As now Hankapa will have it. Close the gap out here. Marchant has it back. Double man to take him. Now finds a duck knee. Now Sutter again to Hankiskin. Hankiskin is shot. Logged away by Allen. Nearing down the end of the second period, it's still a 3-0 game. They're trying to make this one quick out there, and you know they're going to get a lot of help. Well, Canadians are having a little bit of a hard discussion to make, but you just need something else to go right into it. Kolakovic to Sabakovsky. In the center. Able to make the shot. Hold up by Ottinger. He's still not going to leave up behind. That's what happens because if Ottinger just really have to get away with this, you don't want to make that one feel like you're out of the zone. But great passing, safe connection. That's what Star's done. They've done best. Sutter given again to Heskinen. Went right around it. The shot is blocked and goes by the goaltender. Now the Canadians wins the faceoff. Pavlicevich is on his way down. It's Alendra, now finds Smith. And there's a penalty call. This is going to be a tripping hazard. Not a tripping way to do this because that what happens to Angela. He's in a penalty box. That's a bad choice.
Now Montreal Canadiens will have their turn for their power play. As right now with 5.32 to go, it's still a 3-0 game. Matheson gets the clock fail. Good stop by Ottinger. Monahan to Clawfield. And there's another penalty. This is not going to happen well because there is too many penalty roughing on the calls. This is not going to happen well. Fast guys in the penalty box. It's going to be a 5 on 3 advantage for the Canadians. Now their three players are on defense, ready to do this one again. Here's Matheson. Looks at his side, take away from here as Ottinger can get that out of here. This pass is not going to make that one feel uncomfortable for them. They just really want to make that one feel like they are out of their minds. That's a hard one to take. Shot stopped again by Ottinger. Ben clears the ice out. Canadians have their advantage here with just only 108 to go, 440 left in the second period. Sapkowski right towards the center. Toward the right, gloved up and stopped by Ottinger. He's just doing really well out there, energized, and get right into it. Still a lot of time left. No goals for the Canadians, they're still looking for a goal to get on the board. Waiting for again, Caulfield, shot, good stop by Longbiss, and it goes to Fletcher out of the way. Pearson, back to Magnuson. Pearson, Monaghan, blocked by Robertson. Stop by Ottinger. Looks now at finding again. Now here's another switch off. Matheson to Caulfield. Shot goes to Suzuki. Can he get it? No, he does not. This is a hard one to take. Matheson's shot went wide. And Robertson will clear this one out. With a new group change. Ten seconds in the power play run. And that will be it. It's a tough one to say that the four players are going back and bounding. And now they're five. They're an even strength. It's a lot of great hustling bounders. It's a lot of hard work be credit. They're just trying to get that one out of here right at the moment of timing. This is not what happens. Because they get tired out there, this offense is going to be a lot harder to try to stick it up. With no power play goals for the Canadians, it's a 3-0 lead for Dallas to take it things off. Here's Karkovic. Shot! Good stop by DeAndrea. Here he comes now. Babeski around it! Oh, he did not have that one out there. <laughs> nice stop by Allen. Here's Caulfield right towards the other side. Hit him out! Slug in the move, and it's another huge stop by Ottinger. Goes to Babelski. We're under two minutes remaining in the second period. Looks to Ben. Shot and blocked. Caulfield right into the other side of the range. Toward the corner, finds Mapeson. Caulfield again. Rejected away. Too many bodies in the way. The Stars back in offensive zone, now taking their time. That's the biggest collision out there. Just one minute right now as Anderson will have it into the corner, back towards the wall. Sarkowski, take the poke, check the way by Jay Battinger. That's a poking on that one, Ron, because this is not what happens if you don't want to make this one go backwards. You want to make sure you have to give that one a huge call. That's what they are doing. They're trying to get right into this. Johnson back now to Segan and right around it with just five seconds. Harley, get back to Segan. Backhand release, blocked away. That ends the second period. It's a one goal game, 3-0. No power play for the Canadians, but it's a lot of great stuff by Ottinger. Full game takes a quick break and ready for the third. We are down to the final period. Hope you're having a fun time here for a Saturday game. And we're hoping you be ready to get this one settled and ready for the last period of regulation. Hope you all enjoyed this one. And this is a fun night between the American and the Canadian team. We've seen many of them 
as there are some bunch of players right in between the mound for another huge battle. The one thing with that's best right now, I have to tell you this. It was Colorado and the other team of the Winnipeg Jets. This was a tough one there. How does this really happen now for the Canadians and the Stars there, Beast? They're really that tough to be honest right now. I have a lot of courtesy to make that one feeling. This was really the tough one. They did best. And I can tell you now, they're doing a lot much harder than they've done. And scores, and that one takes a 4 nothing lead over the Canadians. Fantastic move. I must tell you that Hintz was pulling up a record this time. Says, look at this train. He had two goals in this game. That was all it did. That is a blowout. Yes, I have a good feeling for Hintz right now. If he gets his free goal, he will take his hat trick and have that one out for the Stars team to try to pick up a run. I love how the setting is put up. With the, with the wraparound look, he had that one right away down and towards the target. But you can't just tell about how well he does. It was a perfect setup for him. For Hintz to try to keep that one in there, not tough one at all comes. But that's what happens most of the time. They got a lot of good settle scores. Heskadin has that one back in. Johnson will have that one right away towards the back of the net. Bass broken up by Heskadin. Anderson back the, into the Montreal to the star zone. Dandenau getting all over the battle about. With another switch up. Gets revenge and Johnson had that one right again to Sutter. Heckapod now finds Marchand. Shoots away Allen with the big stop. Fast broken up as Slavkovsky will take over. Anderson away! Shot stopped again by Oninger. Pass out of Segan. He's on the way. 101. Ankled it. Pass broken up as Matheson will take it over. Monahan right into the right wing. Shot blocked by Hankapon. Recovered by Sagan. Monahan didn't want to lose it. Another big stop by Oninger. That bad pass turned it over. Huge stop by Ironjar. That's me right towards the right wing. Looks over. Hankapa. Lost that one quickly as the defender was getting risk at it. Robertson now pulls it away. Fouling for a loose puck. Finds Hurley with the recover. Passing over to Dutchney. In the middle. Scores! Look at this motion! They are going crazy for the Stars goal! They're all saying that Sagan got it all. And Dutchney just got a release bit. He finally has his first goal. This pass was one motion timer right toward the back. You can't just really say when you give that one a back pass over again to Sagan, that was a crazy look. This offense got a lot of huge stop. That is a hard one to maintain. The Stars extended now for a better position, a 5-0 run. They have been an absolute best ever to go racing into the Stanley Cup playoffs. They already lost two times in a row against the Avalanche, but looking for themselves to get the win and then pull it back in. Pavelski now finds Lindell. Lindell on his way down. He's going to go for another one. Now this time it's Mandible. After Allen is checked out, it's all for him. And all rests up for Allen as Mandible will have his first save of the night and now ready for the faceoff. Now for the win for the Dallas. Lundqvist went down. Robinson gives to Pavelski and he lost that puck. Robinson will have to try to give it over to Lundqvist. Looks again to Hintz. Shoots away. Montembeos will stop from here. That's number two in his game. Fans going so loud and ready for action as right now we come down to 13.42 to go. With the win, as, as right now Harvey Pinard will have it over now to Caulfield. He's on a muscle inbound. Shut! It will be denied again by Ottinger. He finds hints. 
taking a big hit. Pavelski recovers the puck. Hence on his way down. Looks in both. Oh, Martin Bull says, that is what I have called for a free time stop. It's not enough to make that one maintain it. But you can't just really make that one feel like it's uncomfortable for him. You're really trying to make that one go off. That was hard, and it took it from here. After a big save by the goaltender, now here's Harvey Pinard. Up to Suzuki. Hold that stop, and it's another huge save by Oninger. Oh, Kovacevic will now give off to Mapleson. Anderson right towards in a slot. Try to make a move, but Linda will have it back. Stop the play inbound as Delangelo will have it in. Taken away as Fox Cup gives to Lindau. Back him! Oh, a good stop here as another one takes a big save out of the mark. Here's Anderson, you will have that one right inbound. Takes a blue whoop. Always coming down straight. And a big stop by Ottinger. With a huge mark. Firing the cannon to flex away. Now Smith gives over to get into bed. He's in, the, he's in right now with the Montreal Canadian zone. Ben tries to give it back over to get to Smith. He lost that puck and went far out. Now they will have to regroup here in offense with just the midway mark of the period. Pearson gives to Matheson. Now Pekovic hit the pad off. Nice stop here by Ottinger. The Stars are back in the offense zone in the Canadian territory. Looks to Hankapa. He gets bunched out. Tries to recover it again. Pearson takes away. Turned it over as Hankapa have it again. Hankapa on his way back down again to the offense zone. Across the boards is Kovacic. Now finds Pearson. Recovering again is Matheson. Looks to Gallagher. Mohan! That's enough of a way to make that one block out. Ben, fasten the puck here again. Right now, over to Segan. He finds Dutchney. With the release of Canyon. Rebound again by my friend Michalka. No. Have a bitch already getting it for Caesar. Pizzetta right into the right. Covered and block inbound. Now over again, right finding Dutchney. Sutter lost that puck. Armia with the, with the recovery. Segan right towards the back. He goes stopped. Now finds Pizzita. Now it's Canadian's turn. Sutter takes it again. Now finds Ben. Ben on his way down. Get back to Segan. Toward the backhand. Another huge stop by Mondragolt. Armia right over it again. Firing around the puck. Back again to Robertson. He finds Hintz. Hintz lost the puck as Armia will have it back. Looks towards Mazzita. Huge stop and the save inbound by Ottinger. Goes back the airway and Evan gives to Armia. Shot. Good stop by a goaltender. He's looking like he was uncomfortable right now, this way. It looks like his energizer is still going. I can't believe that Ray J. Ottinger just really got it all. He just really loved it. And that's what happens most of the time. They just can't get away with this guy. He's too good. Now finds Heskin in with the puck. Robertson towards the corner. Shoots away! Good stop by the goaltender as Pavelski grabs on. Linda takes it over again. Pavelski. Open look. He scores! Mr. Pavelski of 451 career goals in this game. That's two in a row. You feel like that Joe Pavelski was able to get this one straight. That's a hard encouragement. He got it down. He sniped it and it just went right by. That's how you beat the goaltender? You've got it all covered down. It's a lot of great fandom in the hustle as, but Joe Pavelski has two goals. We got a great race inbound in between a seat right in between a pence and Pavelski. The next one's going to be able to take it for the, for the hit, so it looks like we might find out what's going to happen right now. You'll find out right away. Back to you, all. And there is a major trip penalty as this one calls for a tripping. The Canadians will have their power play advantage 
and ready to take their advantage. That's what happens now because uh, Long Vest is finished. Who we have the call? Let's find out what fan has. It's because of Jason Robertson, he's really into a great offense run. It's all pressure on him because he's been delivering himself with the offensive run of the night. I have a lot of great feelings about him. He's been doing excellent and really well encouraged. D'Angelo right again to Foxka. Now I'm finding a hand for pop. Now I'm back again to Monahan to Suzuki. Suzuki on his way down. He finally has Monahan. Tries to deliver a shot. I am just too close to make that call. He just stopped right away. That's what nobody is getting there. Jake Ottinger, he just really had a lot of courtesy to make his own timing run. A stop by. They're really over this one there. Linda blocks his shot. Wow, the stars are in quick response. They are just going crazy big. Man, that is tough and you can't just get away with it. I know. Tough when it all does happen now. They're making that when you feel like, wow, they're on a great run. Montebo will give it off to Anderson, and now the Pearson is back into the Stars territory. Locked away. Tries to cover up for the puck battling inbound. Heskin in, battling across. Pearson to Monahan. That's blocked up. Choppy on the move. Pearson shot way too hard and went right towards the back of the net. And that is it. The power play is over for the Canadians. Man, they're trying to get that goal right away, but this was not how it is happening like this. They've done a lot of great defense, and they are stepping it up for the, for the race towards the Stanley Cup playoffs. They're doing excellent work. This main danger offense is really like onto its pressure. I can't tell you how they were doing it. They just really are pulling a lot of percentage right away because that inbound turn the best as they can be. We're nearing down to 90 seconds remaining in the third period. Geyer saved away by Ottinger. And Harley on his way down. Gets smacked. Bang recovers it. Looks to Johnson. Tries it but it misses again as the save puts up by Mondragon. We are under a minute remaining in the third as this one, the stars will rise up it looks like they are on the fun one to do another takedown against the Canadian team. Oh yes, they absolutely are doing the best. I can't really tell you, this was a, like amazing. I, this is my favorite one because I really love the USA team versus the Canadian team. That's what happens most of them. And that goal turned out excellent. Time ticking down. Pavelski is going to give a celebration now to the fans. And the stars will have their shot win over the Canadians. And that is it. The Stars take a win over the Montreal Canadiens. It is a blast to take it from the blast into the sky and have it all down. Yep, sky's the limit. That's what everyone does. As for Jake Ottinger, he's on a superstar. It has been a one excellent night. Do we all salute fans? Of course we do. Yeah, I love when this has all happened right now. We always appreciate it. I can't tell you now. It has been a best. Yeah, of course. What a night. With me, Test 2, along with Fan and Son of Beast, this has been a presentation of the NHL on EA Sports. Thanks for joining with us on a Saturday Prime Time. We'll see you next time. All right, thank you so much. Time for three star players of the game. Jason Robertson, an excellent four assist and two gets. And Jake Ottinger with 39 saves. And your first star goes to Root Hits. Two goals, two assists, and a hit. Turn the puck on the string loose and turn out big on the quite on defensive run. Yeah, this all has to happen like that. And I know that they're doing a lot much better than this playing this offense. Gotten great skills at it. They are awesome and they've done the best. Here's how they did with the total statistic of their score games. 51 over 39 for Dallas over Mon Montreal, excuse me. Almost got a little confused, actually. 63 hits over its 24 hits from Montreal Canadiens. 13, 28 for the timeout attack over 4, 14 
Then it was 90 percentage for Montreal over 79 for Dallas. 26 faceoff wins for Montreal over 7 for Dallas. Six minute penalty kill was on was on Dallas, but four minute penalty kill was Montreal. Only a power play goal for Dallas. And finally, the power play minute was 3-12 for Dallas and 4-11 for Montreal. And I have to say this one though, this is a great game. I really enjoyed this one, so looking for another way to get right into this game. Hopefully the stars can take that one out here for once. And you know what I'm saying there, Terry? It's done a lot much harder that the stars rule this, this rank, and that's their hometown. As we always know, we love Texas. <laughs> that's pretty not me. Well, as you can definitely tell, everybody's favorite player, Joe Pavelski and their team, it's been a one epic night. I agree. So that is it for this game. And I'll be back for the next game as we see the Penguins as they are home in Pittsburgh to take against the Capitals of Washington, of the D.C., where the next game at PBG Paint Arena in Pittsburgh. And I hope you all enjoy this game, and for NBAs also. This has been a Saturday prime time night, and we hope to forward to get more games coming soon right in between here. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to his channel. Follow him on his social media on X, Instagram, and TikTok. Link in about page. And also, if you would like to check out the, one of the best of reactions, there's also a playlist here on the Calling Card Info up there. You can check it out, one of the best. And also the seasons here of NHL on EA Sports. From last season and two seasons ago. You're also in here at the end of the video, so stick around here for later. I'll be on the way here just a moment after this ending of this introduction. So with that post game, that has been concluded. Peace out, folks, for a while as the NHL 24 on EA Sports style. Terry Crews is out along with Silver Spoon. Until for the next game, have a wonderful night. Bye-bye, everybody. See you next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.